Hey guys, and welcome to a snapshot video. And uh, I decided I was gonna do one of these videos because uh, they added a lot of new stuff, and uh, I'm very excited. So, first off, they added a bunch of new flowers, they also changed the names. These are the yellow flowers, they changed the names to Danny Lions. The red flowers, they changed textures. Oh, uh, they're called poppies now. That is called a blue orchid. Uh, I saw these inside of a uh, swamp biome. So, you're gonna go find those, probably in a swamp biome. And, uh, this is called an allium, I believe, if I remember. Yep, oh yeah, memorization for the win. This is, oh, blue azot or something like that, I think. No, as I blew it. Okay, I got it mixed up. Yep, so I don't even know where you find these ones, but, uh, they look pretty cool. And, uh, they added red tulip, an orange tulip, a white tulip, and a pink tulip, which is cool. And this is called a white oxide, or just an oxide. Oxide, oxide daisy, okay, something like that. And now they added these two block high, um, flowers. This is double tall grass, which is, yeah, double tall grass. So it's two block high. Sometimes you find them in plains. These are two t two block high ferns. They're called tall fern, large fern. So, uh, they they have the small version of these. Like you see here, they have the small one. And, uh, there's a fern. I don't even know where. <laughs> but, um, then they added, uh, a sunflower, which looks pretty amazing. Uh, but in the hot bar, it's just a yellow thing, which, uh, isn't the best. So, then we got, uh, the lilac, which is personally my favorite out of all these tall ones. Oh, it looks really nice. They had a rose bush, which looks also very well, very well, very good. Um, they added all, I don't even know what they, they added peonies, I think that's what they called. Uh, looks pretty nice as well. They, they changed that to the de de decoration blocks uh, item thing. So, they added that. Uh, they added also new biomes. This is a roofed forest. It looks pretty cool. I burnt a lot of it down on that side. Um, they added extreme hill biomes that are like plus. It's called extreme hills plus. Uh, they're a lot bigger and stuff like that. I believe they added a biome named Savannah biome, which is uh, a desert, but it has a... Uh, clay and stuff in it. It also could be called a canyon. I haven't found one yet. Uh, I went searching about 5,000, 10,000 blocks away and uh, didn't find one. So I'm guessing they're going to be pretty f rare to find unless you spawn in one. Um, there is also deep sea, which is just a sea, but it's deeper and all the floor is just gravel. So if you ever need gravel, go to one of those things. Uh, I also learned in the deep sea that uh, uh, the the respiration three doesn't really work. It actually makes it pretty dark. Uh, so I'm wearing a respiration three right now. Um, yeah, so it makes it, it's actually pretty dark, so you can't see anything, and uh, there's no clay down there, unless you get really lucky, which uh, I don't even think they spawn there anyway. So they also added new fish, which is they had these are the first fish. Then they added salmon, sal salmon, okay, salmon. Salmon. Oh yeah, it's called salmon. Uh, they added a pufferfish and a clownfish, Nemo, and a pufferfish. Um, I believe you can eat them. Um, I haven't really tried, but since they're fish, I believe you can eat them. Uh, they added enchantments to fishing rods. Oh, that's the only thing I forgot. Oh, I was, I thought I was so prepared. So prepared. Um, so, they added luck of the sea, which... I believe you can, with luck of the sea you can get uh, items out of the water, which is a luck. Oh yeah, because abandoned ships and stuff. So you can either enchant the books and get them, and they have lure three, which I think is a faster. It's like efficiency, like the faster you catch fish. So you can take the fishing rod and the books, put them in here. Luck of the sea, and then put that get lure on it. So those, and you can get unbreaking as well, um, so you could throw that in there, you can go fishing for whichever fish you feel like getting. Um, you can also enchant them in an enchantment table, so let's grab another fishing rod, fishing rod. So, you can go here, level 30, lure 3.
Okay, that's not bad. Uh, yeah, so you could just enchant them like a normal tool or anything like that. Uh, they also added a water breathing potion, which is very useful. So the first step, this is the brewing recipe, basically the first step, you add your nether, nether wart like always. And then your ingredient, you you add your nether wart to the water bottles, your ingredient is going to be a puffer fish. And then after that you get a three minute potion of water breathing. Um, you could add a redstone to make it eight minutes. You can add a gunpowder to make it two minutes, fifteen. Oh, let's switch around. And then you can add a gunpowder and a redstone after it to make a water breathing six minutes. Um, and that's all the ones there. They also added these new blocks, which I think you find this one. I think you find it in a savanna or canyon biome. This one, I have no clue where it is. I'm sorry, you guys. Um, but my guess it would probably be in a in a savanna biome or like a jungle biome or something. They added this packed ice, which I love. I test this out. It does not melt. Glowstone right underneath. It's been there for about 30 minutes now. So uh, I'm gonna love this block because uh, I can add light. It does not. It doesn't go see through, but it's not gonna melt, which is gonna help. Um, I believe I covered everything besides the new settings they added. Uh, there's sound settings. They added music, weather, stuff like that. So now it's raining. <laughs> Mute. It's got one. Uh, they added jukebox and note blocks which is gonna annoy me I don't really want this one here because I do pranks and they could just lower it uh, blocks and environment this means when you're walking and, and uh, breaking I think uh, this means like sheep and animals and stuff uh, you can mute those uh, enemies mobs and stuff players uh, that could be very useful mute everything besides blocks and players in UHC that would really help they also added uh, I believe it's here. No, wait. No, no. No, I don't even know what that is. Uh, video settings. They added chunks. They're in a distance to chunks. So you can see 12 chunks away, which is uh, 16, yeah, 16 by 16 by 12. And I'm not going to do the math. Max frame rate. You can increase it. Unlimited. I'm going to. That actually helped a bit. Um, you could change particles, mini map, mip, mip map levels, which I don't even know what that is. I'm not going to touch that because I was off in the first place. I'm guessing it makes me lag. Uh, don't really want to touch that. But I'll raise it just to see what it does. Oh. That is what you call... Oh, no. I don't know what it does, actually. It lagged for a second. It really lagged really bad. I don't know what it, what it is, but whatever. Uh, let's go back to video settings and put it back down. That's pretty much it here. They added these super secret settings, which I'm gonna open up my F oh, leg. I'm gonna open up my F3, so you can see there it says true, right? Uh, you go to super secret settings and it adds the shaders. So you can't really tell. I don't know why it says Minecraft shaders. It added a random music sound. So supposedly we got shaders, which the leaves aren't moving. Oh, that might. That should help. There. That should m maybe get us shaders. Nope. And then if we... There's a bunch of new settings. You can change it. It becomes... Uh, really weird. The blocks look pretty cool though. But it does lag really bad. So I do not suggest this. Uh, they added this one. Which you guys can see. And... Uh, this video would have run a very long time if I hadn't, uh, done anything, if I hadn't cut this bunch of this out. Uh, it was like another ten, like another five minutes or something like that. So, anyways guys, like always, uh, thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time. Pull Bear out.